Well, I think the most embarrassed I was looking back at last year. Yes. Um, it was the week of, of my wedding. So obviously I was quite tense and I had a new sofa being delivered. Now, I hadn't elected for the new sofa to come that week. Right. Uh, it was also the week that I was getting married. Also, we sadly lost the Queen. So it was very mixed emotions. Mm, for me. Right. Emotions were all over the shop. Right. And the company phoned up on the morning that the, the sofa was being delivered to say, with you between eight and one we'll give you a phone call when we're half an hour away mm, that sort okay. of procedure so, so far so good yeah oh, very yeah. nice and uh anyway then then they phoned about an hour later saying we'll be with you in half an hour then an hour went past there was no sofa they phoned again oh we're with you in 15 minutes okay mm. half an hour went past mm. still no sofa then they phoned up and said oh we're, we're outside we're by the bp garage there's no bp garage near where oh, i live dear. so uh, they said oh i think we're, oh, we're actually we're actually half an hour away five minutes later they I get another phone call from, not them, from their head office, Bristol number. Uh, I said, oh, I'm so sorry, Mr. Hanson, but your uh, your sofa from Soho Home, which sounds great in a Bristol accent, um, <laughs> is is not going to be with you today because the driver has been blue lighted to hospital. He's had a, he's gone into cardiac arrest <gasps> in the van and he is being taken. And I, but, but five minutes ago, like, five That's minutes ago, great. it was coming. They were fine. So within five minutes, I mean, it's fantastic for ambulance waiting times, if yeah. it's true, because yeah. they're, they're off they go. Did you see the um, petrol prices at the yes. BP garage? Yes, exactly. And they just and sent him into cardiac arrest. <laughs> that was it. So anyway, he's, uh, they, it was a Saturday, and they said, uh, OK, well, well, we'll be delivering your, your sofa on Tuesday. I said, two, why, two, like, that's two whole days. Oh, we don't, we don't work Sunday or Monday. So yeah, pass, pass the problem on to the they consumer. Don't work Mondays? No. I know what a lovely what a lovely job. Anyway, and this was an external courier company. We should just point out. And uh, anyway, on the Tuesday, I said, "Okay, well, I can't really do Tuesday. It's my wedding rehearsal on that day." And they said, "Well, that's that's the only slot we've got." Said, but then I get married. Then I go on honeymoon. I need the sofa. I've got family coming. I need yeah. I need a sofa. Please can't be stood for four days. Exactly. Um, and I mean, it's, it's fine for all the national anthems on television with the Queen. Exactly. But yes, other than that, yes. it's 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 yeah. not good. So they. Um, Anyway, they, pr- they promised, okay, between eight and one on Tuesday, I said, okay, I'd just like to let you know I'm going to miss my wedding rehearsal for this. My 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 husband now will go, but I will miss it. I mean, I... My husband will go, as in... Well, he wasn't married at the time, but my... No, my husband, my, my husband fiancé be, yes. will yes. go to the wedding rehearsal. Oh, I thought you yeah. meant as in he's going to leave me. Oh, no. I thought you were... <laughs> I'm only marrying you for thick. the sofa. No. If you don't deliver this sofa, he's gone. <laughs> he's curtains. out the door. <laughs> anyway, so they, they then... They, I promise, I promise Miss Hanson to be with you on Tuesday. Gets to Tuesday, we start this routine again. We'll be with you between eight and one. Mm. We'll phone you half an hour away. Then at nine o'clock, I get another phone call from that Bristol number. I'm so sorry, Mr. Hanson, but uh, we actually won't be able to deliver your sofa today. We haven't actually taken possession of your sofa. <sighs> and I, at this point, oh. dro- I dropped to the floor. The, the rug was pulled back, ready for the sofa delivery. And all the emotion and stress of the wedding and everything else everything. that was going this was your... came out and I I broke down in disproportionate amount of tears on the phone. It's your Michael Whitehall Mugabe moment. Yes. And I said, but I'm, I'm, I'm missing my wedding rehearsal for this. And I did at one point, I think, say, the Queen has just died. <laughs> and she didn't know what to do. And she kept, Mr. Hanson, breathe. Mr. Hanson, breathe. <laughs> And she then, after trying to calm me down, went, hold on, hold on, and puts me on hold for three minutes. I am in absolute flood of tears thinking, I don't know how I'm going to tell Mikey, my, my husband now, uh, what is going on. And she phone, she comes back on the line and says, Mr. Hanson, I'm so sorry. I've mixed you up with another customer. I'll be with you in 10 minutes. <gasps> oh, no! And it, and it turned up 10 minutes later. <laughs> and I have, I have lost all dignity. <laughs> to this poor woman. Oh, it's a dear. lovely sofa. I have to say. It's, it's, it's worth it. it. As I said to my now husband, it's the nicest thing I've sat on all week. So it's lovely. <laughs> um, which he was very touched with. Yeah. Other than that, I was fine leading up to the wedding. Wow. I like to think. But it's, pro- but it's probably helped having a release before, yeah? Did you yes. cry at the wedding? Did I cry at the wedding? wedding? Yes, I did. Yeah. Yes. Did you cry more at the wedding or at the, <laughs> the news sofa. that you weren't going to get your sofa on Tuesday? The, the sofa. <laughs> but it, it was a different type of it emotion. It was a different yes. type. Yeah, it, yeah. Was, it was rage right. and stress. Yeah. yeah. God, I'd have been livid. But, a sofa's for life. Husbands may come and go. <laughs> exactly. Yes. And hey, they refunded the £35 delivery fee. Oh. Which oh, I felt they could have done nice more. Nice touch. And the driver pulled through in the end. Yeah. 